Well, hi, everybody, and welcome to this Bulls Digital Update. My name is Paul Peck with Bulls quarterback Tyree Jackson and defensive end Damone Harris. We are at Mid-American Conference Media Day at the Pro Football Hall of Fame in Canton, Ohio, a different venue for this setting, guys. So you guys were the benefits of being a part of a very cool event. You guys got a personalized tour of the Hall of Fame. Damone, what was that like for you? I mean, it was a great experience. Um, I felt like a, a little kid in a, in a candy store, you know, seeing all the um, past sports memorabilia and all the great players that have played this game and really laid the groundwork for us it was uh it was neat and I was I was really lost at words for it Tyree how much of a, a fan of the history of the sport are you maybe even more now uh, I think coming here I thought I I thought I was a good fan of the history of the sport but then you come here and you see the guys from the 50s 60s stuff like that when they're wearing nose straps as helmets you know so I think just seeing all of that just really made me more of a fan of the game and more grateful of the people before me and the timing was great because in about a week the second match player will enter the Pro Football Hall of Fame. That would be Jason Taylor from Akron, the former Dolphins great. He'll join Jack Lambert from Kent State in the Hall. Uh, you guys both got a chance to meet him. What was that like meeting a Hall of Fame guy? Uh, I think sitting, we got the chance to sit out him with dinner and just talk to him about the experiences of the Mac and what it took to get to where he's at, where he is at now. And I think that he was a real humble guy and he was real nice to us. He treated us like we were just normal people and it was a really nice experience. Plays your position Demone, right, yeah, he was uh, he was very personable, like Tyree said, um, very humbling guy, and uh, it was it was a great opportunity that we had to talk to him. I'm glad I've never talked to anyone uh, from the Hall of Fame before, so definitely a great experience, great guy, you know. And we just talked to him about his experiences in the NFL and also in the MAC. There, there's the inspiration that he plays your position for you, Tyree. You know, we marvel at your size and your physical skills, and and let's be honest, a lot of the guys in this building have the size and the physical skills, and then added the determination and focus on top of it. Did you feel that a little bit when you walk through there? Does it ever occur to you that, boy, if I do what my coaches tell me and what I know I'm supposed to do, it's not inconceivable that you might wind up in a place like this yeah I mean walking through there it's real it's real it gets you real excited you know looking at all those guys and I mean everyone in the NFL is talented but those guys are special because they put in the hard work and you know like Jason Taylor was saying they put in the extra hours before everyone was going home after practice he stayed the extra two hours so you know just working hard really is what I got from from this experience is that part of your job to continue to remind him of those oh, things? for sure for sure I know that's that's what your teammates supposed to be here for we remind each other every day to work hard. I mean, you can't do it alone. All those guys, I bet, had great teammates. They're not just great individuals. They're great teammates because the football is the ultimate team sport, you know. So being a great teammate and having great teammates, I think, is also something that will help get you to this point. Camp opens in about a week or so for each of you guys. For you going in as the starting quarterback, how is it different than a year ago? I mean... I wouldn't necessarily say it's different. I mean, yeah, I'm going to be taking all the first string reps. I'm going to be working out with the first team, getting the chemistry with the receivers. But as a competitor, I still go in as if I'm still in a competition. I'm still going to go out there every day and work hard. And I know that the guys behind me are going to push me and I'm going to push them. So I think it's just uh, you got to have that same mindset no matter what. You've been a starter, but now you're a senior and a leader and a lot of eyes are going to be on you at any point in the game, in the huddle, in the halftime locker room, in the practices. Are you ready for that? I mean, um, it's it's a it's like you said, it's it's a responsibility. It's not an accolade. It's a responsibility being a leader on this team. But you know, I'm I'm gonna take on that responsibility, and I, I think I'm ready for it. My coaches have prepared me for it. You know, my experiences have prepared me for it. You know, I'm just excited to get back to work on Monday with my teammates and you know, um, hit the ground running. All right, we thank these guys for joining us. Great experience for them here at the Pro Football Hall of Fame in Canton. It's Mid American Conference Media Day. Tyree Jackson and Damone Harris, a part of this Bulls Digital Update. Thanks.